What's up, YouTube? It's Learn of Lake Empower coming at you, and I um, I'm doing today a video on why I love Korea. It was an inspiration after watching Expat Carrie's um, video, and so I thought, why not? I'm here, and I really love this country. I love the culture and the people, and so it's important for me to just acknowledge that. So the first reason why I love Korea is the warmth and the generosity of the Korean people. Now, I first encountered Koreans in Toronto, Canada, back eight years ago. I was teaching English, and I um, started teaching Koreans, and they were so good to me. They were so kind. They were so generous, so warm-hearted. Actually, they encouraged me to come to Korea. They said, we need teachers like you. Some of them started looking up posts, positions, when I eventually found a position, I was met at the airport. They came with banners and welcomed me. Um, and some of them, as they came back to Korea, a group of them came to my town and, you know, spent time helping me get um, set up. They set up my computer. They did a number of things. That, that's people that I knew before I came to Korea. When I arrived here in Korea, I, had, I was coming here to teach English. My employer was incredibly generous. Um, and he set me up in a really great space, um, helped me connect with people, um, did some favors for me because I was coming to Korea as a single parent with two boys. So my situation is unique in that most, um, most teachers who come, they're coming, you know, single and younger and that. I was coming in a different situation and I'm telling you, I had the most amazing experience being embraced and recognized and respected and i'm speaking at, at that as a black woman who um very often you hear stories about koreans being um, racist and i was told that before i came but um yeah i have had just the most incredible experiences with koreans the warmth the generosity the um embracing people bringing them in as part of a community their hard working nature, their geniuses in so many respects. I'm inspired totally, as you can tell. I have so much, I only have good things to speak uh, to about Koreans. The other thing that I love about Korea is new and old sort of side by side. So um, to give you an example of that, we live in a city where um, there are lots of new buildings going up all the time and, and we live in a, a new building. We're the first tenants in this building. And just outside our building is a patch of a plot of land where people are planting their gardens and, um, you know, and you will see some little old little things or you will you will see maybe somebody, uh, you know, an, an elder, uh, like what you would call a, a grandfather, you know, passing by with his wheelbarrow picking up you know um what uh, collecting stuff so just just it's just incredible or something like some an elder with his wheelbarrow and going along as though this is a totally different era and you will see him answering his cell phone or taking out his cell phone or something to that effect so new and old existing side by side um what's the other thing the dynamic culture and people Koreans are very often, you know, people, I've heard, I've heard stereotypes of who people think Koreans are. And when I tell you that they're dynamic, I've had the opportunity to teach them. I've had the opportunity to consult with them, um, to be close by them. And they are some of the most dynamic people on the planet. They are not one dimensional at all. They're very much, you know, they can do they can do so many different things and they participate on so many levels. They inspire me. I said that before. I'm saying it again. The culture, the, the landscape, the people, you name it. Koreans, when they call it dynamic Korea, they have it right. The other piece is the community, the relationship-oriented culture. I come from Jamaica. That's my birth home that's my born land so to speak and when i was coming up being embraced you know being part of a community was very much part and parcel of how jamaicans are and it still is and i i moved to canada and i i didn't feel that connection i'm telling you 
coming to Korea, I've experienced that again. Koreans have a way of drawing you in and embracing you and making you feel part of the landscape, making you feel part of their family, part of their community, part of whatever, their school, whatever it is that they're into. They'll make you feel that you are part of that. It's up to you if you want to get involved or not. But for me, that's very important. And for me to find a group of people who embrace the values of relationships being so important very very key so those are my points i wanted to state i know that Arirang had um a contest a couple of months back but obviously i wasn't involved and so this is just from my heart to koreans and korea why i love korea thanks for watching have yourself a great day